all. And did you know that May is National Chip Your Pet Month? A local animal, animal clinic is encouraging people to protect their animals before it's too late. KX News reporter Sanji Milburn tells us about the benefits of microchipping your pet. It's the sound every pet owner should hear, a microchip. It's something we've been thinking about doing for a long time and we're glad we finally got it off the to-do list. Brady Gugju and his wife were proud dog parents of two. But when one of their dogs went missing, that's when they knew it was time to get them both chipped. We've had a scare. Um, our oldest dog got out of our garage one day and we didn't find her for 30 minutes to an hour and we got a little nervous, but she did come back, thank God. But many aren't so lucky. Animals are either left for dead on the street or end up in shelters that are overcrowded. We get 100 calls within a matter of a week. Um, somebody, have you seen my cat or dog? And it's one of the leading causes as to people not getting their animals home. According to the ASPCA, 6.5 million animals enter animal shelters nationwide every year, which is why officials say that it's best to get your animal microchipped so both of you can be safe than sorry. I mean, it's as small as a piece of rice, a grain of rice, which is really, really quite small. And it's a quick, simple process, literally takes, you know, less than a minute to do. It's another option on top of having them collared and tagged. And once the chip is scanned, an online registry will identify the owner's info. As for Brady, his dogs are family. And with the chip lasting a lifetime, he has one less thing to worry about. Reporting in Bismarck, Sanji Milburn, KX News. About 710,000 animals who enter shelters as strays in the U.S. are returned to their owners each year.